So now I would like to introduce the 2017 ITC program chair to, to uh, introduce the uh, paper award for 2017, Peter Maxwell. Good morning. Before I announce the best paper award, I'd just like to say uh, a few words about the selection process and at the same time give another plug for these uh, yellow cards. In the, the best paper selection process starts off with the initial reviewer ratings of papers when they were sent out to reviewers in the uh, program committee and, and, and other reviewers. Those reviews are used to create a short list of papers as candidates for best paper. So that's one of three categories that we take into cons uh, consideration. The second category is the, uh, are the yellow cards and the ratings by the attendees. So we do take, uh, pay attention to the ratings given by attendees. That's why it's important to fill out these cards. Uh, and so that's the second component. The third component is that during the actual presentations, uh, members of the program committee uh, attended these presentations and gave a, a review on several aspects of the actual presentation, uh, the ability to answer, answer questions and this kind of thing. And in order to, to, to get best paper, excellence had to be shown in all of these three categories. So then with that as background, I'd like to announce, if I press the right button here, yes, the best paper award for 2017 uh, was entitled a single pin test control for big A little d devices and uh, the authors are all from Dialog Semiconductor, Michael Lene, Hans Martin von Staudt, Sura Ballero and Mark Eason. Uh, so if I would invite the authors to come up and receive the, the plaque for this Best Paper Award. Now, whereas there was always a best paper uh, award, each year var varies from year to year whether there are other papers that uh, show uh, uh, particularly high in, in ratings and, uh, and reviews. And so this year, I'm ha happy to announce that, th that there was such a paper, and this uh, is the Honorable Mention Award. The Honorable Mention Award is safety analysis for integrated circuits in the context of hybrid systems. And uh, the authors of this paper are V. Prasant, Ruben Parachi, and Bharadwaj Amritur. Uh, the first two from Texas Instruments and the third from the Indian Institute of Science. So if, if the authors are here, I'd like to present the award. Here's, here comes Ruben. So with that, I'll I'll hand it back to to Lee.
Okay, next, uh, <clears throat> I'll introduce uh, Yelvan Zorin, the TTTC president, to give the award from the TTTC side. Welcome. Morning, welcome to ITC. This is our new year in ITC and we have lots of exciting things to see together. So I'll do a few TTC awards. Um, the first one is the Lifetime Contribution Medal. This is the highest level award that IEEE has dedicated to test technology. So it's only for test technologies who made a fundamental impact on the field and we, we present it here at, at ITC. Now in the past, Several senior members of our community who made lifetime contribution were recognized with this award. Many of those faces are familiar to you most probably, uh, or you have seen them during the past uh, announcements of this lifetime contribution award. This year, the new recipient of this award will be somebody, again, familiar to you, Professor Sudakar Reddy. Professor Reddy has been in our field for some time and I'm sure you recognize his face as well. He has started his career uh, by studying at the uh, Osmania University in Hyderabad, getting his bachelor degrees, his second bachelor degrees in electronics and communication, his master's degree again in India, in Bangalore, from the Indian Institute of Science, and then he moved to the US, to the University of Iowa, where he did his PhD in 1968. Since then, he has been part of the faculty of the university. And until today, uh, Professor Reddy serves the University of Iowa uh, in that capacity in the electrical and computer engineering department. He holds the position of foundation distinguished professor in the university. And uh, he has done research, as many of us know, in the field of VLSI circuit testing, DFT, CAD. In addition to the research though, he collaborated with the industry quite often so he created lots of numerous uh, novelties, innovations that impacted the industry over a period of time. So Professor Reddy has major contributions. First of all could be his PhD students that he produced numerous PhD students in academia and industry, many of them prominent people that you know well. He published his research work in a large number of papers. Not too many people have 650 publications. So this is a very large number of publications in terms of sharing with the community. He received most significant paper award from ITC in 2016, um, most contributed author from ATS, same year, best paper award from EDNTC, also he's a life fellow of IEEE at the same time. He received other awards such as the Humboldt Senior Research Fellow Award in 95, as well as he was the first Lifetime Achievement Award recipient from the International Conference on VLSI in India. For all the work that he did as a uh, educator, as a mentor, he made a fundamental impact on test technology. So I'd like to invite Sudaka to receive his award, the Lifetime Achievement Award. Thank you, Yarwat. Uh, you know, you cannot achieve everything in life without your collaborators. I would like to thank my over 50 graduate students who have worked on the thesis research with me and collaborators, uh, especially Professor Edith Pomeranz of Purdue University, Dr. Bern Becker of uh, University of Freiburg in Germany, Dr. Janusz Rajski from Mental Graphics, Dr. Rutan Cheng from Mental Graphics. Uh, it has been a pleasure working with all of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, moving ahead, um, you all know that IEEE Fellow 
elevation is an important one. In fact, the grade of Aitzotli Fellow is one of the highest honors that can be bestowed upon our members by the Institute, the Institute being the IEEE, in recognition of their technical achievements. Only select few members of IEEE, in fact, 0.1% annually, are elevated to this level of fellow. It is based on election process by a specialized committee that does that. Um, today, we're lucky to have two of our test community, our TTC members, prominent members who have been elected to 2018 fellow level. So I'd like to recognize them and invite them to congratulate them together. The first one is a familiar face to you, is Mark Tehranipur. Professor Tehranipur has been uh, very active in the field of security, as we know. He, uh, his contribution scientifically and organizationally has been a lot. So I'd like to invite Mark uh, to congratulate him for receiving the Isotli Fellow Award in 2000. I said we are lucky to have a second person also this year among us uh, who received the fellow award and again a face that you may have seen before and that's Professor Wang. So Lisi Wang from UC Santa Barbara. I told you Van Dong need to pull me, but he said we need to take a picture, so sorry about that. <laughs> okay, another important award that we established a few years ago, back the first time was 2015. It's an award in memory of Bob Madge. Many of you know him. Uh, it's an innovation award. It's an innovation award to the field of test and yield. Uh, some work that impacted the test and yield field in the industry. And uh, the person who receives it is the person who has done uh, midterm impact. So we're not looking at lifetime impact, but other five to seven years of window. Uh, as I mentioned, we awarded the first time in 2015. And this comes based on nominations that you could uh, create, you could uh, request for, for coming years. Um, and this can be selected by a committee that we have from industry and academia jointly. So this year, the recipient of the award is Krish. Professor Chakrabarti has been in the field for a considerable amount of time, and he has contributed in many aspects to our field. He contributed to two and a half 3D test methods. He contributed to microfluidic biochips, again, test and DFT solutions. He contributed to hardware security with a test angle as well, and he has been with us as a pioneer for over 20 years with numerous contributions. So I'd like to invite Krish, to receive his special award. So Maria Madge, the, the, the spouse of late Bob Madge, will be presenting the award. Very good. Um, just to remind you that we have the best doctoral thesis award as well, which not be presented now, we'll be presented at the closing plenary session. This is named after Professor McCloskey. As you know, we have competition at different continents in the world throughout the year. This year we had the competition at VTS, ETS, ATS, and LATW, four of our sponsored conferences. And uh, the finalists from those four conferences will have the competition session today, this afternoon. You see it in your programs. And as a result of the selection process that will come out of that, we'll be announcing the winner, the best doctoral award uh, thesis winner of this year 
on Thursday. <coughs> one more element that you also know of, this is also for students like the previous one. This is not for the technical side of it, but rather for the service side of it. So uh, Jerry Gordon Student Service Award is a joint ITC TPTC award that is given for one student per year for volunteering to test technology activities, volunteering to our efforts. Um, we have done it again for a number of years. This is again based on um, nominations that come from different conferences in this case. So if you're a conference organizer and you see a very good student, you can create a nomination and the person can win this award. This year's award winner is a student uh, from China. She's Wen Li, the recipient of this year. She's from the University of Chinese Academy of Sciences. Thanks a lot for helping us with the nomination. Huawei, uh, she helped us with the international test conference that is ITC Asia. ITC Asia was held in Harbin, China, and uh, she was one of the fundamental people behind the scenes in organizing the conference. She also helped later on at ATS, uh, as well as the CTC, which is the Chinese test conference. So a student like Wen Li would be a very uh, uh, key person to organize those conferences, as well as receive this special award. Thank you. <laughs>